guys, welcome to the vlog. I just, I just have to take a moment of appreciation, right? The people who washes or clothes, I'm telling you, they do such a good job because right now my clothes smell so clean. I just showered and like when I was putting this shirt on, I just smelled how nice it smells. I remember when we used to drop our clothes off before and I think that has something to do with why we had stopped dropping them off and I just wanted to go myself and like wash them myself because I love when they smell a particular way and I just wasn't getting that from the laundromat that we used to drop them off at. Not realizing that sis, you could just change the laundromat and you get a different experience, you know? Or at least I wasn't thinking about it and I also thought that when I dropped it off, it costed more money but then I realized that it depends on how much clothes it is because most times now when we drop them off they end up costing way less than if I were to go on my own and like wash them myself because I'm so particular and I just be doing the most most times to be honest you gotta buy the stuff to wash the clothes and all that and everything is already provided at the laundry ramp but now the clothes smell so good Sis who be washing them, she's washing them with love. I'm not gonna lie. You know how some people just be doing a job and they don't really like their jobs? Like, my job that I used to do, I absolutely loved my job. And I feel like I've always known that I liked customer service because I always got so happy when it was time to help somebody unless they wanted to be dumb. You know, as long as they were fine, then I was fine helping them too because I loved the interaction with people. And I just loved my job. And I feel like the lady at the laundromat, she actually loves her job. She loves washing. Because she... <laughs> this sounds absolutely crazy right now. She, I feel like she puts so much love into washing these clothes. Because they be smelling so good when she's done. Anyways, since I've gone off there for a little bit, <laughs> I'm waiting on my husband to get home. So we can go drop the clothes off and go to the grocery store as i'm talking about the grocery store i think i need to get my phone and pretty much go around to see what i'm gonna need because i feel like when i go to the grocery store right now i'm not gonna go again for a hot little minute because whatever i'm gonna buy right now is supposed to last for a while so right now i'm gonna take this time to go around and see all the little items that i need here and there and actually get those but um yeah i thought i needed to pop in and share my appreciation for the lady who does the laundry it's the little things you know watch you get up and make a plan for the day and it not going exactly how you want it so i got up and decided that i'm gonna sweep and wipe the floors and stuff and for the most part i did get up and start sweeping but then when i was in the living room sweeping i seen my um my nail polish and i'm like damn i've been looking for this nail polish for so long let me just polish my nails real quick and then right after that i have to sit and wait for my damn nails to dry real quick and then now it's 11 o'clock and i'm just here plus i was talking to my friend just now so it's like that really put a damper on the day so right now i'm just picking up pretty much after myself i'm gonna put this stuff from like my polishes away and stuff like that and then I'm actually, okay, gotta be that loud. I'm actually gonna um sweep, wipe, and come back in here and chill for a little bit. I think later we're going to um a little like backyard barbecue cookout type situation. I think I'm gonna eat a fish later. So that's pretty dope, but right now I need to get the house cleaned up. That is the motive for today cleaning up I already swept my rug I feel like I was just talking to my friend when I was telling her rugs always just accumulate so much dust and all that shit and it's like you just don't know where it comes from but it's always mad dusty I sat for so long and waited for my nails to be dry and I feel like they're still a little bubbly not even showing anyways they're still a little bubbly so um I'm gonna just pick up around here like I said twice ago and oh Love the bit of greenery on there. Um, yeah. I need to actually start doing this before the next thing you know. 
I end up doing something else. And my friend just told me that she's gonna come back in 10 minutes too, so I need to finish sweeping this in 10 minutes. Hey y'all, so um, it's currently 9 a.m. Is it 9 a.m.? 9.44, almost 10 a.m. And last night we went to a little barbecue that Dwayne's uncle hosts on like Friday and Saturday nights, and it was so good. Last night I feel like I drank more than I've, I've had in a hot little minute. But it wasn't terrible because this morning I didn't wake up with a hangover or anything. I've been pretty good at controlling what I drink. Love that for me. But um, this morning I wanted to see why well, I look so overexposed. This morning I wanted to see if I could go to Marshall's because that all white thing is coming up and I feel like I need... A nice little pair of either um platforms or something to wear there's that because i feel like all the shoes that i do have all my heels are black and i'm wearing all white and i don't know i don't see it going in my head so i wanted to go and see but also just woke up by the ways i don't know if it's super hot outside and truth is i'm not really i don't want it to be super hot because i cannot if it's still hot. I mean, there's a bus out there that I could take all the way up there. I could certainly do that so I don't have to walk. Maybe I'll do that. But yeah, I want to go see if I can find that. And then today, last night too when we were there, Dwayne's aunt was telling me that there's this boat ride that we went to about two summers ago. And when I tell you that boat ride was everything, it was literally everything such a good boat ride so she said that that boat ride is coming up again so um today she's gonna go get her nails done by about 12 o'clock and then she's gonna see if there are any more tickets and if there are if there are she's gonna get one for me and jody and then we're gonna go with her because shit is fire so um that i think i already have something that i could wear so i'm not worried about that what did i wear that i need to go check search through my phone to see what i wore i know the romper that i wore i can't remember what i wore on my feet but i did bring some slides to change into because when you want to get down and dirty gotta have a change of shoes but um yeah that is the plan for today i just woke up and was laying in bed watching a little video and then i'm like let me come see what's up so I have this wig that I'm trying to um, straighten out for my aunt. Last night I was supposed to do it, but then we were just having such a good time. And then I started drinking and it was not safe anymore to straighten the wig. And then I also have this one that I also need to straighten. So I'm going to go in on these two. And then you know what? I have one for myself too that I want to straighten, so I'm gonna go get it out of the drawer over there and work on it. So yeah, that's what that's what we have going on right now. I'm waiting for my flat iron to heat up. As we're as we're on the topic, yo, my flat iron is such a good one. Such a good one. And I think I paid just a few dollars for it on Amazon because I was struggling to find a good one. And when I read the reviews on this one, everybody was saying that it's amazing. It heats up so quickly and it works nicely on the hair. I'm going to show you guys. <laughs> 